guys, Ellie here. Um, so I'm going to be taking you guys on a journey using Dot Products DPI 8X. Um, the whole idea of this project that I have been working on is to be able to go in and scan a space and then take that space and, and bring it that into SketchUp and be able to model um, from the data that I collect using uh, Dot Products product. Um, so we're going to jump in and we're going to get started and I'm going to show you guys the whole process from start to finish. So I then take the DPI 8X and I make my way around the kitchen collecting all the data. And that's it, I've literally captured everything that I need in under five minutes. A really good way to bring your data into SketchUp is to use the plugin called Undep. It's really simple, you just have to change your file to an IPCP file um, from the dot product file um, and then you can import it. Once it's imported you can then navigate around the model, you can see all the data that you've collected. You can then start to play around with the model, cutting into the data so that you can focus on particular areas. Working from a bird's eye view, you can then start drawing in the surface areas using the point cloud data as reference points. So then using the push and pull tool, I can then start creating my model from the point cloud data. You're then simply just going around the rest of the point cloud and you're using all the tools in SketchUp to build your 3D model. You're literally just reading the data that you've recorded. So really now it's, it's you know, just a sense of putting in the textures and bringing in like the cooker and things like that. So how I do that is um, SketchUp has this really cool thing called the 3D Warehouse where it's literally just a library full of content. Um, so you can just literally type in what you want, search through it like a catalog and download it straight into your model. Um, so I'm not going to build the cooker. There's thousands of cookers on 3D Warehouse. So I literally just find one that's very similar to um, the one that I have in, in that kitchen um, and I just import it and I slightly adjust it to size and then I start adding textures and things like that to make it basically as close to how my kitchen actually looks and that's it, it's as simple as that I'm just here to show you how easy this process is of taking the DPI 8X, scanning a room, taking that scan, that, that, that project and how you can like put that into SketchUp use it as reference points, model from it, um, and then basically the world is your oyster and you can do what you want. 